Hi guys, welcome to another Divi theme video. This is Jamie from System22 and webdesignandtechtips.com. Well, this is another in our series of Divi for Beginners videos. In our last video, we created a little hero section here. So you've created the rest of your page now and you want to save it and you're happy with it. You want to set it as your home page. That's what we're going to do today. Let's enable the Visual Builder. Okay. Once you finish your work and you're happy, the usual procedure is to hit the little purple button down here, expand it. You'll see two little buttons here, save draft and a publish. Now a question I quite often get is, I've not got a save draft, all I've got is a save button. When you first save a page, you'll always have a save draft or publish button. If you publish a page, that means it can be seen on the web. If you save a draft, it can't be found on the web. So if you do some edits and save a draft, then come back later, you'll still have these two buttons. But notice what happens if I hit publish this time. I'm going to go ahead and hit publish. Now all we see is a save button. Now every time we go to edit this page, all we will ever see unless we unpublish it is a save, not a save draft button. So once you've saved it and you're happy with it, you may want to set it as your home page. Now we briefly went through this in another video the other day. Really easy to do though. So once you're saved, you can go ahead and exit the Visual Builder. To make it the home page, go down to your dashboard. We're going to roll down. We're going to go to Appearance and Customize, or you can go down to Divi and go to Theme Customizer. They will both take you to the same place which is this page here. Now here's the page that we've got set as the home page at the moment. Whatever you've got set as the home page or whatever the available page will always appear in your theme customizer here. Now we want to set our new page as our home page. So let's roll on down. Just before you get to the bottom, we've got home page settings right here. Left click on that. And we've got some options here. Now, by default, WordPress usually has your latest posts checked and you'll have your example blog post page appear here, which is usually Hello World. In fact, if I do that, let's put that there. This is usually what you'll see. This is the default WordPress page setup. Obviously, we've got our logo and everything in there. We want to set our brand new page as our home page, so we need to check this a static page. just under we've got a home page here we can select the page that we want the page we just saved was actually called rose so if i click on it here we get when you're happy make sure you hit the publish button now if we visit our site we've got that page set as our home page here really easy to do and you're going to want to do that at some point that's for sure if we go ahead and enable the visual builder and go down and hit the little purple button again you're going to notice as we said you've only got a save not a save draft button there great well there you have it guys there's how to save draft or publish your page and once published how to set it as your home page don't forget if you have any questions pop them below the video i'll do my best to answer them for you or make a little demo video like this one once again this has been jamie from system 22 and webdesignertechtips.com thanks for watching have a great day